All right, what's up, guys? Welcome to some more Fallout 3. Uh, thank you for all the support on the part one. It was absolutely awesome. And uh, yeah, we're going to do a part two and see how we go. Please do drop a like if you want to see this as a full series, 100%, uh, and I will commit to it. So I did want to say as well, at some point soon, I'm going to be finishing off Mass Effect 3. I did like eight videos on that, and I haven't done one in at least maybe four or five months, but I want to go back to that. I really want to finish Mass Effect 3. I just got distracted with other things here on the Apex Sound 2 and the main channel. I think it was around the uh, the time of release for 2K23 and stuff like that as well. Um, so yeah, I didn't get a chance to really finish it, but I want to go back to that. And Dragon Age Origins, I want to go back to as well. Um, I've done three videos on a playthrough over there. I think I should still have my save here on uh, the Xbox as well. So let's jump in. Let's do this thing. And uh, I'll be going back to some other series as well over the Christmas period. So we're going to talk to Colin Moriarty and, here and see what he has to say. Life. You know where your father went. Seems to me you ought to be out searching the wastes. Yeah, we already talked to him about pretty much everything, honestly, so... Um... Is what it is. Okay, so yeah, someone was telling me that you could turn on the light for your BB by pressing the B button. Or, not your BB. Um... No, it is what... Is that what it's called? See, I'm getting mixed up because I just watched a Death Stranding video where they talk about the BB. Um... They call the baby the BB. It's, it's called a Pip-Boy, isn't it? Yeah, Pip-Boy. There we go, not a BB. <laughs> there we go. I am stupid. Anyway, let's get the hell out of here and let's go to the Wastes, I suppose. What are the... I don't think we have any quests really left here, do we? Let's find Galaxy uh, Galaxy News Radio, I suppose. Let's have a look at the map and see where, where it is. I, I imagine it's quite far away. Yes, it is indeed. All right, that's going to be a hell of a walk, boys. We don't have any fast travel points across the way either. Because considering how long it took us to walk up to the other place, I can't imagine how long this is going to take us. Yes. It would be nice if there was a quicker way to get there, but... Tel Aviv. So yeah, we did a lot in the first part. We escaped the vault, obviously. We did the the vampire quest. We did the uh, the disarming the bomb quest. Um, so we, we got a lot done in the first video, and I'm planning to get a lot more done in, in this video as well. So please do drop a like. Uh, I know this is a, a long game, a very long game. So I will plan on kind of uh, doing longer videos per part as well, just so we can make sure that we get a decent amount done. I don't want, obviously, to have like a 500 part series or whatever it may be if we were uh, going to be doing everything in this game. And we were only doing like 50 minute videos or something. I'm not going to be like fucking Rad Brad where he uploads 20 minute videos and has a 100 part series or whatever. That ain't my style. Oh, shit. What's up now, boy? I forget how to play the game. There we go. Low AP? Still, really? Haha, <laughs> son of a bitch! That one missed, really? Come on, how is this not doing more damage? There you go, you son of a bitch mole rat. Alright, I'm giving the mole rat while I want it. No, I don't want to give him my fucking... Okay, I was, I was giving the mole rat my pistol by accident there. That's certainly not what I want to happen. Oh, there's someone hanging over there. Is that a kid? What the hell is that? A dwarf? Oh my god, look at the size of that thing. That's what she said! <laughs> I don't know! Run, dude! Oh, we have no ammo for this thing still. Shit. Are you good, bro? I'll try and save your life. Am I even doing any damage to him whatsoever? I don't think I'm doing shit to him. I genuinely don't think I'm doing a damn thing to this man. Like, I don't... I don't know. This just seems very bad. Yeah, no, that's not doing anything to him. Like, legit nothing is happening! Oh my fucking god. Okay, let's try hit him with a baseball bat. Come on, boy. I'm gonna die here, no doubt about it. Oh yeah, no, I'm run, I'm running. Run, bitch! See you, dude. It's been real. I had fun. I'm out of here. Definitely can't kill this dude. That's good to know, at least. So, we gotta let that other dude die. Well, I guess we distracted him long enough for him not to be. The other guy can run now, surely. The other stupid idiot that I risked my life for for no reason. He's still chasing me. He's still chasing me. I need to find a place to rest or something, cause. I've taken a lot of damage there, and I don't have any goddamn ammo 
for my shitty handgun. I probably should have bought some, actually, before I left town. But it's fine. I'm not worried about it. I'm a little worried about it. Oh, we leveled up. You'd think a little level up would give us a nice bloody, um... Full health or something. I'll go for gun nut. That sounds like a fun one to have, at least. Oh, shit. You're fucking shooting at me, bro? I don't have any... Ah, oh, God. We're screwed here. I think we came the wrong way, sir. What if I go down into the metro? This seems like a terrible idea, but... Maybe. If I wait three hours, do I get some health back? No. Damn it. Thought for sure I'd get some health back here. Ooh, a metro ticket, though. Cryogenic chamber with a robot in it. Lovely. Bitch ass mole rat! Come on, you wanna go with me? I'll beat the shit out of you! What's with all these bottle caps, by the way? I see you, mole rat. What's up, baby? Oh, there's two. Shit, we need to drag this one out. No, they're both coming. Well, that's unfortunate. Get this nicked good, my friends. I'm gonna beat the fuck out of you, dude. Boom! Boom! Oh. Come on, baby. Oh, we so nearly died there. Holy shit, dude. Come on. Oh my god, man. I need some health. Like, can I get a stim pack somewhere? The love of all that's good and holy. First aid box. Oh, thank god. We got a stim pack. Beautiful. Beautiful. Let's use one. Okay, we've used the stim pack. We got other shit in here as well, though. Well, I tell you, I didn't mean to sit on this chair. Use the typewriter, is that what we're doing here? I mean, might as well just take everything, right? There's something here we could do with this, though. Activate this. I'm guessing this opens the door. Unlock security safe. Begin gas main flow test. Due to a class 7 system failure, all service engineers are required to report for duty. Failure to report will result in termination per clause 45.7a of the maintenance service union contract. Have a pleasant day of work. All right, where was the safe? Oh, right here. Shit, yeah. Hell yeah, baby. Laser pistol. Oh, yes, dude. That's what we needed. Some new fucking guns. And we're ready to rock. Oh, my God, dude. There's so many of them. Do you think I could throw a frag at these dudes? Release the Kraken. Dude, throw the nade. Oh, oh shit. Okay, wait. Good night. Come on, you feral ghoul, yeah. Let's go. Come on. I need to be using the uh, the thing that slows down time. What do they call that again? I can't remember. Vats. I need to be using the vats more, though. Even in situations like that, just to give myself a moment to breathe and get, like, a new weapon out and shit like that. Your weapon is in poor condition and can do more damage if repaired. You can repair items in your pit boy or by visiting a vendor. To repair it yourself, you need to use parts from a similar weapon. Okay. But I definitely don't have that right now. We got anything off these guys? Just bottle caps, okay. We did we did fuck two of them up with the grenade, to be fair. Because it's kind of dark all of a sudden. Okay, I, I have a key for this way. There's also something down here, though, was there? No, I thought there was a ladder down. There wasn't, in fact. I nearly fell down there. That probably would have ended up being the end of me. I'm going to save the game, just because, you know, Brucey. good to get a, a save in every now and then. Brucey. New save. I hope this is the right way, you know? Don't know what I'm doing in this game at the moment, boys. Oh, what the fuck is that guy? Oh, Jesus. Oh, no. It's a super fucking mutant. Run. Can I sprint by any chance? 
Oh my god, dodge and weave, dodge and weave, run. Run, 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 run. Run. Oh. Hey, bitch, fuck you. Wanna try to hit me like that again, boy? I'm going for three headshots in a row. I don't care. Gotcha, bitch! Come up on me like that again and see what happens. Come up on me like that again and see what happens. Headshot! Oh, get your goddamn headshot off! Satisfying as hell that was. See you later, bitch. I'm so low on health still. I think I got some new stuff to, for health, but I don't know if any of it was, like, decent. Is the only thing. Yeah, what's up now? Keep oh. running at me. Got you in the leg, I don't care. I'll shoot you anywhere. A bobby pin and a harmonica, we really need something to heal us right now. Like, badly. Alright, I've, I've used a lot of stuff to put my radiation up, but we needed it to get my health up as well, so... Why does this kind of remind me of the vampire place? It looks very similar. Eerily similar. Except it's more broken down. I'm running out of ammo for it already. I think I have ammo for this as well, though. No, I don't. I thought I got some ammo for that, but I didn't. I was wrong. I probably shouldn't be wasting all my laser ammo. Ooh, a paint gun. Well, interesting. Okay. Good news for me. Oh, what the fuck? Okay. Those guys weren't attacking me. We're fine. Nuka Cola. I think those do give you health, actually. Nuka Colas, right? If I'm not mistaken. Thank you for using Metro. Enjoy your visit. Thanks, buddy. All right, we're out of here. Finally, we got out of this place. Although it looks almost scarier out side for some reason <laughs> i'm a little more terrified out here let's check if that nuka cola gives you health we're real close to where we need to be i'm getting shot at i'm getting shot at i'm getting shot at i'm running i am running oh my lord help me out guys yep wow you guys helped me out thank you very much <laughs> hello night captain calvin you're in the middle of a fight i'm guessing you don't want to talk Oh my god. Okay, I'm just taking this little... Okay, that kind of seems a little fucked up, honestly, but... Sometimes you gotta do what you gotta do, you know? Maybe his one isn't as broken, though. His weapon might not be as broken. Let's try it out. Is his laser pistol better? Yeah, it does more damage. And it doesn't need to be repaired as much. Oh yeah, baby. We'll use that as our repair... As our quick... Alright, you killed the super mutant? Good job, dude. We got a sledgehammer, too. Nasty. Welcome. All clear, Sentinel. Five mutants released from their torment. The rest are keeping their heads down. Good. Okay. What about you, Sentinel Lions? What do you have to say? As far as GNR, but keep your head down if you don't want it to get blown off. Yes, ma'am. The name's Sarah Lyons, Sentinel and Squad Commander of the Lions Pride. We're with the Brotherhood of Steel. Okay. We do our best to hold back the super mutants in this area, but when civilians stumble into our sights, that gets a bit difficult, doesn't it? Hey. There aren't a lot of safe places in the ruins right now. But the Galaxy News Radio Building is sort of our port in the storm. Unfortunately, the building's been hit pretty hard lately. We're their backup. So if there are no more questions, we really need to move out. That's a negative. <laughs> We've got too many local conscripts as it is. Most are undertrained and too damn trigger happy for their own good. Our very own Initiate Redden is a sterling example. Sterling? Watch okay. Yourself out there. I'll follow you guys. A new recruit? I'm on your six. One that blundered into the uglies over on 42nd. Welcome. All right. Ooh, lots of energy drill. cells. Redden, you just do whatever Paladin Vargas says and keep your mouth shut. Want that helmet. Yes. Give me that power helmet, baby. I want it. Power armor? Train power armor training is required to equip this item. Okay. I'm with you guys. Oh, shit. So dark, dude. It's so freaking dark, it's insane. All right, here we go. Hit him a little torso, torso shot or two. I'll swap over to this guy, hit him with a torso shot. Bang, bang, bang. Gotcha, sucker. All right, up, up in the window, okay. Left arm crippled, baby, let's go. Ooh, a hunting rifle, shit yeah. That sounds great. And definitely use that. All right, I'm following you, buddy. Let's go. All right, let's go. 
One headshot. Two body shots to be safe. 98% on the body shots. Headshot. Let's go. Critical strike. Sucker. Satisfying. It's satisfying when you get it right, I must say. All right, let's go. Dorsal 78%. Let's go right, left arm. A little cripple shot, maybe. Ooh, I got hit. You want some? Go for a left arm and a headshot. Boy, I think I might have got him with that headshot, you know. Gotcha. Woohoo! Let's go, baby! All right, I gotta manage my ammo a little better. You are no longer well rested. Damn it! Hello. All right, we'll get better as time goes on, guys. I'm still, I'm still early days. I'm still learning. That X is worn off. Okay. All right, no need to do that. That much extreme shit right there. Shoot him in the back. Shoot him right in the back, baby. Really, you missed both of those. Really, this isn't doing shit. It feels like. I guess my big gun damage isn't that, uh, isn't that crazy, huh? He's dead. To be fair, I don't think I was ever going to be doing as much damage as these guys. Oh, assault rifle. Okay. Shit. Now we're starting to get a lot of a lot of guns. Oh, I'm over encumbered. Shit. All right, we need to get rid of some stuff. Let's get rid of. Oh, this is it though. This is Galaxy News Radio, right? What's up, buddy? Talk to one of the knights. They can help you. Okay. Talk to the knights. What was that? Hello? Hello? I'm scared. Papa! Oh my god, look at the size of this dude. Holy shit. Why would I shoot the paladin, man? Come on. Alright, let's try just... Tee off on him with the assault rifle. That's what I thought. Run away, bitch. What's up, baby? Yeah, you don't want to see me, man? That's okay. <laughs> Sucker. Keep shooting him. We don't even need to use bots on this bitch. Just bait a little bitch. Yes. That's what I wanted to do. Yes. Yes. I want to shoot all of my own people and not the actual enemy. For sure. Critical strike, baby. He's going down. Come on. He's going down. You're dead, son. You know you're dead. I know you're dead. We all know you're dead. And that's why you're running. Come on. Get you with the laser. I'm chasing him. Fuck it. I don't care. He's low. He's scared. He's running. Come on. Why are you running from me, boy? <laughs> got him. We got him. How many times are we going to have to shoot him here? Is he... Is he glitched? Yeah, what's up now, boy? <laughs> Let's go, dude. Oh my god, the amount of shit this man has is insane. Look at the amount of stuff this dude has. Stealth boy, missile. I don't think we need a missile. Shotgun shells. We don't have a shotgun yet, so whatever. I mean, that was awesome. We messed that fool up badly. How about that, baby girl? Redden was good enough for the pride, and she proved it here today. Yeah, I mean. God damn it. Oh, Redden died? Back to the Citadel. I'll talk to the scribes. Let it be chronicled that Paladin Redden passed her test. Come on. Let's see if they've got any. Mini nuke? What are, the, what are these, man? The mini nukes. Fat man? Oh, is that what that is? I'll take him. Damn it, I knew it. I knew that was gonna get me over uncovered. Hello? Looks like it's all clear. Unlocking outer doors. Thank you. 
Appreciate that. Damn right. We need to sleep. We need some health. We need to find our papa. What's up, Night Dylan? Indeed. Nice to meet you. I'm Knight Dillon. If there's anything you need here, I'll try and help. You got a pip boy. Tune into Galaxy News Radio and listen. It's the only radio station in the Capital Wasteland that really tells it like it is. Okay. I'll go right on up. You were expected. Thanks. Three dog. Just stay out of our way and everything will be fine. All right. No need for that last part, but. I'm at your service. What can I do for you? This is Galaxy News Radio. The last free voice of the people of the wasteland. The Brotherhood of Steel makes sure of that. Okay. Three dog is right upstairs. Thanks. Okay. All right. So, did we just get like a, a grenade launcher style weapon here as well? Is that what the? Uh... The look Are on you the man? Face says it all. Mm -hmm. You're wondering who the heck this guy is and why you should care. Well, prepare to be enlightened. I am. Three dog, jockey of discs and teller of truths, lord and master over the finest radio station to grace the wastes, Galaxy News Radio. And you, well, I know who you are. Heard about you leaving that vault, traveling the unknown, just like dear old dad, huh? Met him already. Oh, okay. Hey, hey, one thing at a time. Nah, I knew it. I knew he wouldn't be here anymore. Not We're not going to see him until the end of the game. Heard old three dog on the radio. Figured I knew what was what out here in the Capital Wasteland. And he was right. So I filled the old man in. But he split. Looks like I've got my way of contributing to the good fight. And he's got his own. <laughs> You're going to have a good fight on your hands if you don't help me. <laughs> Imagine a picture, okay? A picture of the Capital Wasteland. All that brick and rock. A whole lot of nothing, right? There's people out there trying to just barely make it from day to day fighting to stay alive and make something out of what they got. But then you've got all kinds of shit. Slavers, super mutants, raiders. They all want a slice of the pie too. And aim to take it by force. So people fight back. They can't, not against those kind of enemies. They just run away and hide or they stay and die. It just ain't right. So that's where I enter the picture. I fight the good fight with GNR as my gun. The sound of truth goes out across the Capital Wasteland. Hell, someone's got to counter that bullshit on the Enclave Station. Words don't kill people, guns do. I understand your fight, but I still need to find my dad. Sorry. I'm so used to talking to an audience that can't answer. I just assume you want to hear my voice all the time. So, you want to know where your dad is? I'm going to have Fair to do enough. something for you, huh? We got one rule in the good fight, though. You want help, you got to contribute. Do it. You want to find your dad, and it just so happens his location is known to yours truly. He was here at Galaxy News. We had a great conversation. He's a real stand-up guy. If you want to know more, you're going to have to contribute to the good fight. Mm-hmm. I knew that. Look, Three Dog, if I find my dad, maybe he can help with the good fight. I like what you're saying, but this is bigger than just you and your dad. Knew that wouldn't work. If you want help from Galaxy News, you need to contribute to Galaxy News. That's all there is to it. All right, Good, let's do this it. This isn't gonna be easy. Let's help him. Galaxy News Radio is my baby. I love it. I feed it. I keep it changed. But there's one problem. No one outside of DC can hear her cry. You see, some brainless super mutant thought it would be funny to shoot at the shiny round thing on the Washington Monument. Yep, that shiny thing was our broadcast relay. Now it's Swiss cheese. Without it, our broadcast range is quite limited. Of course, the factory that made the relay dishes is long gone, leveled, as in, we're never gonna scavenge that part again. It is risky. I would never lie to you. But there's something behind those eyes. I just killed a big ass super mutant, I'm so I'm the one good. I'm get shit done. Your dad had that same look in his eyes, too. That's why Three Dogs helping you. All right. One of the Brotherhood guys that passed through here mentioned seeing a dish in one of DC's old museums. It's the dish off the old Virgo 2 lunar lander in the Museum of Technology. I want you to get it and bring it to the Washington Monument to replace the bad one. That's it. Let's do it. <laughs> I sure know how to pick them. 
You're gonna be the best thing that ever happened to Galaxy News in a long time. That doesn't even make if sense. You need any more info? I'll be here waiting for you. You're gonna be the best thing that ever happened to Galaxy News in a long time. Like that, that you're contradicting yourself right there, buddy. Come on, man. Let's do this. Can I sleep in a bed at least, bro? Like, can you give me a bed? I just need a rest. Well, I'll be honest, I did not mean to come out here yet. Wow, I can't come back in, fuck's sake. You're kidding me, dude. For the love of all that's good and holy, I needed to sleep. I can't believe that, they skamazed me right there, man. Oh shit. Oh, fucking hell, you feral ghoul, calm down, bro. Like, calm the fuck down, mate. Right. Oh my god, look at that. Absolutely exploded this poor man. I say poor man like he didn't deserve it. There was another one. I heard another one. Where are you at, boy? Alright, we got more ghouls. All good. These guys are easy. Give it a go. Gotcha. Alright, good stuff. I hear another one coming, though. Oh my god, look how fast the close this man is to me. <laughs> See you later, buddy. Unreal. Unreal. Alright, we're pretty much out of ammo here. So let's switch to a, a different gun. Let's switch to our laser gun. We were to collapse car tunnel. I just need a bed. So I can sleep for the night. And bloody get some health, you know? That's all I need. I can't see shit now. Let's turn the light on. Let's turn that bloody light on. I hear an enemy. Or I see an enemy on my minimap, but I can't see him. Alright, come on then. I'm I'm ready. I'm down for whatever, baby. I'm down for whatever, baby. Good night, Irene. Like seriously, good night. How did you come up so close on me, man? Like, where did you even come from? A little bitch, man. I'm actually about to die here as well. I'll put my stealth boy on. Oh shit, we're actually like near on invisible. We should use this right now. Dude, no way. This is fucking sick. <laughs> Dude, this is awesome. Okay, I think I'm going the right way. And how long does this last? I don't know, but this is dope as hell. I think I could just like fucking come up on this fool and, and kill him. And no one else would notice. I think I probably could. Cause he ain't see me. That was beautiful. Good lord, man. Yeah, I'm just sitting in this man's ashes. That's sick. <laughs> that, I'm a sick man, bro. And we got a stim pack too. Oh, let's go. That's awesome. Alright. First aid box as well. Lots of good shit, man. Lots of good shit. Oh my god, lots of enemies here, boys. When I say lots, I mean there is a lot of enemies here. We're gonna have to use this... No! Are you fucking joking me? That is the worst possible time for that to run out, man. Like, just the worst possible time for that shit to run out, man. Wow, that's so unfortunate, man. I can't believe this. Why can't I use my fucking rads, dude? Bats, rather. Not rads. Ah, oh, fuck me, we have one from here now. Come on, come on. Yes, I killed that one bitch. Come on, 
Using these all- I'm using all these nades, I don't give a shit. I think I got them all, to be honest. Holy shit, we nearly died, but I think we might have got them all. Raider, we'll take the 32 caliber rounds. We'll take the cake, thank you very much. I don't need whatever shit- other shit you have. I'm good on that. We get them all? I think we might have killed them all. Let's go. What's up now, Raider? And we got some 10 millimeter rounds as well. That's good. Brass knuckles. Jesus Christ, I need a bigger bag or something, man. The power helmet and shit I could probably get rid of because I'm not able to use those right now. And they they weigh a lot. Yeah, that, that should work now. Right, there's still shit down here. Yeah, see, I feel like this... Yeah, okay. Science skill of 50. Fuck that. How am I going to get past here? Let's see if we can fuck this thing up. Go for it again. Yes, got one. Alright, got one, got one, got one, got one. Oh, you fuck off, you. You don't be ruining my bloody... Come on, don't fuck this up, dude. Come on, pussy, what's up, dude? Yeah, what's up now? Bitch! And fuck with me again, you stupid raiders. See what happens. Come on, let's go. Bomb, bomb, bomb. One more, one more. Stupid, stupid. Wanna mess with me? Stupid, stupid, stupid. Come on. Utility gate, open sesame, baby. An enemy right here. Didn't even mean to do that, but whatever. Damn it, last two missed. Quite unfortunate the last two missed, but whatever. All good in the hood. I do want to try out that mini nuke gun as well, actually. Just for the crack and banter, I need to try that out. Alright, we're out of here. Let's try it. Let's try it. Dude, mini nukes. <laughs> I probably should have seen that one coming that that was going to kill me as well. <laughs> but it was worth it. That was fun. <laughs> Holy shit, that's awesome. Yeah, what's up now? Getting shot from behind? Am I? You're kind of cute, though. What's up, baby? Raider, bitch! Critical strike, son. What's up now? There's so many of them, man. I need to let them fight a little bit more. Oh, shit. Look at this fool coming at me. Yeah! <laughs> That's all of them, I think. Let's go. All right, awesome. How far away do I have to be? It doesn't go as far as I thought. Yeah, that killed him. <laughs> Pretty sure that killed him, dude. Holy shit, that was awesome. Okay. Radiation's going up in here. We need to get out of here ASAP. There's just a couple of feral ghouls as well. I don't want to waste my mini new camera. We got to keep that for like boss fights and shit like that. Um, wish I could see something, but I can't. We good. Gotcha. Gotcha. Sucker. You fucking creep, yeah? You want it? You want some too, pal? I'll give you some. If you want some, I'll give it you. All right. I'm being a nice guy, I'm generous, I'm a, sh I'm a sharing guy, I'm a caring guy. I'll give you some too. You fellow ghoul, yeah. Psycho is worn off. Psycho is a way of life, it doesn't just wear off, okay? Everything in my life is wearing off right now. They all last the same amount of- Oh, what the fucking shit, dick, bitch! 
Okay, okay, okay. Ah, shit. I'm dead. Fucking hell, man. Lots of dogs. That's why I need the mini nuke right there. Jesus Christ, there was like five of them. Alright, that's one dog dead. I hate doing this. Especially the cute dogs, but has to be done. Alright, that was just one though. Where's the other fuckers here there? Alright. Nope. Down, run, down, down, down. To the bottom, one more on! Not that fucking difficult, was it? Alright, got them all. There's one more, I think, actually. Alright, let's just go. Get the hell out of here, man. I'm sad I had to do that, but... Alright, that time it just killed him straight away. <laughs> oh, I hear someone. Butter knife, pre-war money, I'll take that. It's go time. Who are you talking to? Also, I can't get up there. Am I supposed to? Am I supposed to be able to? The mall outpost. Oh, activate, there we go. Come on, baby. Oh, cute outfit you got going on there. I have to headshot you though. Sorry, Raider. Oh my god. That's just disturbing. Not cool. Oh, we leveled up. All right. Lock picking first things first. 25. Science I'm going to put up as well. I should probably put my sneak up a little bit as well, to be honest, but we'll do that next time. Uh, speech and barter by five points. We'll go with the scoundrel. Sure. That's a pretty handy one to have, I think. I don't know what the darts do, but... Rog knocked the Barbarian, that's one of those comics, I think. Oh, thank God. Thank fucking God. We'll sleep for seven hours till 1247. Oh, that person's tied up. What's gonna be fun, bitch? Me popping your lights out? What's up now? Is it fun now? Stupid. Seems very quiet. I don't like it. Oh, be quiet. I sneak past that bitch. All good, all good. No way they see me, no way they see me. We're good. Yes, sir. Sometimes you gotta sneak past. Sometimes you just gotta sneak on by, baby. All right now it's time to run. Because they're hearing all those bloody cans for sure. All right, we're out of here. Sweet. We're out of the underground! The mall. Did we make it to our location? Oh, shit! Hey! Fucking hell, these guys have- <coughs> oh, These guys have machine guns, man! I'm running for it! I'm running for it! I'm running for it! Everybody stay calm, I'm running! Get in the museum, just get inside, just get inside, just get inside, just get inside! Jesus Christ! Definitely don't want to be de Oh, well, this was a bad idea. Why did I come inside? Come on, big boy. You super mutant bitch, you. Come on, you want some? Come on, if he wants some, I'll give it to him. But I don't think he wants some, son. Ah! Come on. Yes, sir. Gotcha, super mutant. Oh shit, there's another one. Oh shit. Right, let's try a super uh, hunting rifle here. See if we can hit him with a little headshot. All right. Nope. Nope. Come on, bitch. Yeah! Headshot, baby! Let's go. That's what I'm talking about.
That's what I'm talking about, baby. Wanna give me some dog meat? Activate, activate museum information, okay. Exhibit guide. Robotic exhibits. Exhibit sponsored by Robco and General. Activate Ro Robco Stealth Boy 3001 description. Personal stealth device developed by Robert Mayflower. The stealth boy generates a modulating field that transmits the reflected light from one side of an object to the other by making the bearer almost invisible to the untrained eye. Okay. Dude, this computer over here seems to be on. I need to turn on my goddamn light because I can't see shit in here. Activate research terminal. Okay. Log entry. The virus that has been plaguing our archetype model FF06 mainframe due to an unknown attack has finally been localized by our research team and identified. After a complete cleanup on the mainframe's core, I am happy to announce that the infection has been removed. The soul of this machine has improved. Ebel. Can someone please fix the, pl fix the planetarium projecting system? The automated system that was just installed is prone to malfunctions at least once a week. We've had to interrupt the programming more times than I care to remember and end up taking over manually. I suggest we remove the system and bring back the human element so the audience will feel more engaged. Bebel. All right. Oh, here we go. Shit. Okay. Triple S? I'm scared. I don't like this at all, man. I gotta be completely honest with you. Great! 2% chance I might die in the whole world. Fraction of the sunburn. It feels like we're going back down into a vault right now. Is that what's happening? You can, pal. Or don't be. Step into our entertainer Tron room and watch the, the goat. <laughs> or perhaps listen to a symphony. Another vault tech innovation. The bloody goat. I remember the test well. Concerns about security. Our eye on you cameras enable the vault leader to watch your every move. You'll never be alone again. <laughs> Should the unlikely event arrive, we are in another vault. Will they? We hope you've enjoyed our tour today. If you have any further questions, please take a brochure from our help. We're basically in like a museum that would show what all the vaults are like, which is cool. Whiskey, love a bit of whiskey, but I'm good right now. I'm kind of a uh, activate fire out space facts. Space fact number one: the planet Jupiter is larger than 1,000 Earths. Space fact two: the outer layers of the sun have what's known as differential rotation. The equator of the surface rotates once every 25.4 days, but near the poles, it rotates once every 36 days. That's pretty wild. A neutron star is completely dense and solid matter. In fact, it weighs a trillion times heavier than lead. That means a piece of a neuron star the size of a pinhead would weigh as much as a large building. That's kind of insane, actually. The sun loses almost 4 million tons of mass every second by turning hydrogen gas into energy. That adds up to almost 345 billion tons per day. It's kind of interesting that we're getting space facts right here. And Starfield is on the way. Like, you know they love space, which is cool. They're gonna... They're gonna produce an awesome space game, no doubt about it. I can't wait for Starfield. I hope it's, uh... I hope it's good, man. I really do. What the hell is this? Oh shit! Where the fuck did you come from, pal? Alright, we're good. Yes, got one. All good. All good, baby. Calm down. What did you just pick up, bitch? Oh fuck, he has a fucking nuke thing. Just shoot him in the torso, please. We need to kill him before he does that again. Yes, that headshot was nasty! Yes, come on! Bitch! 
Try and fuck with me, man. Missile. Missile launcher. I cost 20 weight. I'm going to stick with without picking that up. I'll take the missiles, though, because I think that fits the other thing as well. Active. Open sesame. Your boy's here. Activate the Delta rocket. Should I activate the Delta rocket? I feel like that's not a very fucking good idea, but... YOLO. Right down below can't, can't do shit right now, which is good. Got him. Wait, how is one guy shooting? Are you above me? Ah, you're above me, okay. I was confused right there. I was hoping that would knock it out of his hand, but I don't think we hit him. Nice shot. Come on, let's see if we can hit him with a little headshot. Let's go left arm, actually. 59% on the left arm, 25% on the uh, head. Ooh, just missed on the headshot. Dude, why does it take so long to reload this gun sometimes? I think it's the last one takes so long. Let's go. Let's see. That Delta rocket information commissioned by the USA in 2020 was the last of the manned rockets that sent our brave American astronauts to the moon. The Delta was in use for almost 15 years before being converted for military use and having the crew and instrument sections replaced with a nuclear warhead. The Delta recorded over 77 successful launches, making it one of the most successful rockets in US history. Okay, damn. All right, so obviously we're not gonna, we're not gonna activate this bomb or whatever, but. Kind of fun, at least. Kind of fun to think we could. I must be tripping balls, because it sounds like he's close, but I can't see him. Where the, the fuck is he shooting me from, bro? No, I'm tripping Oh, there you are. I was literally, literally about to freak out. I was like, what is happening right now? Miss. No. Damn it, come on. Really? Not one singular fucking hit, you loser? Let's get some cover here. I still haven't hit him. That's embarrassing, dude. Finally. His left arm's crippled. Don't pick up your goddamn homie shit, bro. Don't pick up your homie shit. He's dead for a reason. Bitch. Activate what? Sorry, did that say? Space suit. This has been constantly refuted by both the Soviet Union and China. Defiant Seven's flight lasted for a total of 12 minutes and 7 sec seconds as it achieved one full revolution around the Earth. Pretty nuts. Understand why man is so interested in this unknown expanse of space around our little world? Oh shit, fuck dick. Just go for the head. Three times in a row. Not one hit. Damn it, come on, man. You're a loser. Nice. Shit, dude, this is bad. All right, I know what to do. I've never been more confident of anything in my, in my entire life. Told you, I was confident. I mean, <laughs> I was confident. <laughs> Jesus Christ, that's fucking fun, dude. You now have radiation poisoning. Visit a doctor or take Radaway to lower your radiation level. You can also protect yourself ahead of time by taking Radax, which increases your... Yeah, I'm just going to do the Radaway thing. I do have one. It was only minor, to be fair, but might as well get rid of it while we can. Activate Virgo 2 Lunar Lander. Became the very first manned space vehicle to touch down on the moon. The Valiant Eleven's crew consisted of Captain Richard Wade, Captain Mark Garris, and Captain Michael Hagen of the USSA. We salute these brave and noble men who took the very first steps on a planetary body other than our own. So much later that the old narrator got tired of waiting and they had to hire a new one. Guys, I'm so brain dead. This is the thing I need to take. Holy shit. I'm actually so stupid. Find the Washington Monument. I'm so dumb. I've been looking around here for like 30 minutes trying to figure out what the hell to do. The thing was just right there. Holy shit, I am so stupid. It's insane.
Alright, where's the Washington Monument? This way. I'm gonna try to be stealthy if we can, because I don't want to engage with all of these guys, you know? There's so many of them. I'll try to be a little bit quicker about it. Get out of harm's way here. Alright, let's go, let's go, let's go, let's go, let's go. I, pr I should probably, like, be waiting maybe until, uh... A more safe time of day. I feel like right. Oh, what the fuck is this area? Oh my god! Well, that's really not a good sign. I guess. Probably. You know? I would never class that as a good sign. Can we get in this way? You have discovered the Washington Monument. Are you friendly? Guys, you friendly? Thank you. All right. Can I open the gate from here? Enter password now. I don't have the password, man. Open outer security gate. There we go. Thank you. I thought they weren't going to let me in for a second. That music is fire, though. All right, we're in. We made it. Thank God. All right, there better be a bed to sleep in here. Repair the damaged radio relay. Let's do it. Bring down that elevator, baby. I don't like elevators. They creep me out. Especially right now. This doesn't look like it's gonna be a fun one. Doesn't look like it's gonna be a fun ride, baby. I need to clean my desk off. I couldn't even find my blue light glasses right now. All right, blue light glasses are ready because it's quite a glare, it's quite late. I have a feeling something's gonna try to kill us when I open this elevator. When the elevator door opens, rather. We shall see. Hopefully not. It's a long ass journey up. Activate Galaxy News Radio Relay. Install the Virgo dish and activate the relay, okay? That's what we want to do. Sweet. Uh, repair the damaged radio relay. Activate. I'm going to sleep first. I'm feeling something terrible is going to happen when I activate that. So I'm going to sleep first. Uh, sleep until... Yeah, I'll sleep until like 8 a.m. Why not? And I think this is the perfect time to do this. Full strength, baby! Nice view from up here, by the way. Look at that. Right, so now what? Am I done the mission? Speak to three dog about dad. Okay, there we go. That's what it said. That makes sense. Doors open. Quit buzzing me, will ya? My bad, bro. Sorry. Didn't mean to. Didn't mean to buzz you unnecessarily. What's up, guys? How you doing? Night, Dylan. Nice digs. Huh? Nice, digs. nice digs, yo. What's up, Welcome Sergeant Wilkes? Radio outpost. I'm Sergeant Wilkes, and I'm in charge here. What brings you into the DC area? This is the last free radio station. They all say the same shit, honestly. Area. These guys are like robots, man. Clotted up with enclave propaganda. And with their armor, too. I wouldn't believe a word they say anywhere else. Well, the only other station that comes through nice and clear on the radio is the enclave station. All they spew is a bunch of nonsense and propaganda. Galaxy News Radio reports on what's really happening. Mm-hmm. We have a relationship with the station here. We stay in this reinforced structure and protect it from the super mutants. This is the only real safe spot in the ruins of DC. The rest of the place is crawling with those walking abominations. It's nice to have a port in the storm, you know? Indeed. Sure, good luck to you. Thanks, pal. Appreciate that. There he is. Couldn't find you, three dog. Couldn't see you there, matey. Hey, all right. The hero of the wasteland returns. That's me, baby. Thanks, Three Dog. I was just glad to help with the good fight. Hey, you're the one that deserves all the thanks. You struck a major blow against tyranny. Now, GNR can be heard clear across the capital wasteland again. That'll give Eden and those muties something to think about. But before I get back to my calling, I bet you want to hear about your dad. Yeah, thanks. Please, I miss him so much. Whoa, now. Dry your eyes. A promise is a promise, and I will provide. When your dad passed through here, he and I talked for a good long time. He was a real stand-up kind of guy. He mentioned some scientific mumbo-jumbo which didn't make sense to me. And mentioned something called Project Purity. Hmm. He also said something about going to visit a Dr. Lee in Rivet City. Then he left in a hurry. Okay. Rivet City? He never heard of Rivet City? Wow. I've been underground my whole life, Just man. Wow. Well... A whole bunch of people got together and turned a beached aircraft carrier into a town. Pretty cool, huh? That does sound pretty Just cool, actually. Just follow the river south from here. 
There's no way you can miss it. Okay. How are things now that the power's back? I can't even tell you the love I'm getting from the wasteland. Ever since GNR started singing again, the guys downstairs told me that more people than ever are tuning in. It's all I ever wanted. Okay, don't cry. You're telling me to dry my eyes? Look who's crying now, pussy. Without this place, DC would be filled with that crap the Enclave keeps shoveling out of their radio station and festering with muties. Someone's got to tell the Wastelanders. We can't call them muties. And Three Dog is the one to do it. No one knows what Eden and his horsemen of the apocalypse are up to, but you can be sure it isn't in the common man's best interest. Okay, okay, okay. Three Dog's seen it all. The capital wasteland at its ugly. People killed for scraps of food, wounded children wandering aimlessly, some seriously fucked up shit. If it wasn't for the good fight, I think I would have gone crazy by now. I bet they were interesting. <laughs> Why candy coat the news when the world is in danger? People like the Enclave would have you believe everything is calm and totally under control. They're lying. Clearly. Now, President Eaton goes around spreading peace, love, and government, but no one even knows how old that enclave signal really is. People need to hear the truth. It's a harsh world. We've got to work together to make it better, not wait for Uncle Sam to ride in and save the day. Okay, go for it. I think we're good now. I'll be on my Anytime way. I don't want to disrespect you, Three Dog, okay? Be glad to provide. Thanks, buddy. Appreciate that. We're well rested right now, but appreciate that. Scientific pursuits. I think we've done every other quest that we can right now. I don't think we have any active side quests or anything. So where is this? Uh, where is this place that we're going? Down here. Holy shit. Okay. All right, so this is the way then. What's up, baby raider? Come on, let's go. This guy's got a lot of help, man. Ah, oh, shit. The hell with this? Where are you running to, boy? Don't run for me! Come on, why are you running? Quit running! Yeah. How many fucking extra bullets did that take, bro? Ah, oh, shit. All right, come on then. Let's go. You want to go, Raider? Then we'll fucking go, baby. Just wow, you suck. We got crit critical strike on him, though. Okay, these guys are like trying to surrender, and I'm just murdering them point blank. <laughs> I mean, you want to fuck with me? Fuck with me fully. Why is there that? What is this thing here? Someone explain this to me. So you see the way I have this one here, which is like my actual objective. What's this one here where it's like kind of grayed, grayed out? Like, is that a side objective or something? Because I don't exactly know what that is. And why would I have a side objective right now? I, uh, that's the thing I'm kind of confused about. Like, I don't actually have any quests or anything, it says anyway. I don't know. It's kind of a little bit confusing to me. Back that way, I think. There we go. Railway spikes. Okay, interesting. Yeah, someone explain that one to me. Maybe it's a side quest that I can start up or something, because I don't think I have any active right now. At least it doesn't show them in my uh, in my quest log. If I go to my quest log, it doesn't show any like active quests right now, right? Are you stupid? Oh shit! I'm not gonna do shit, bitch. Hit him with a headshot. Raider head cripple. Love that. Here, yeah, bud. All right, we'll take that. Okay, so I think this is the right way. I think I want to go southbound, right? Yeah, I don't think I want to be. Yeah, yeah. Okay. Oh, shit. Oh shit, reload that shit. Alright, we're good. Everybody stay calm. 
Shit, I don't have enough AP. I could have got a headshot off there, probably. Shit, this guy's got a lot of health, man. I'm gonna die. Oh, thank God. Okay. We good. He had a submachine gun. Okay. I ain't seen that before. I'm not, though. And you are so fucked, it's insane right now. Did you just nade me? Yes, you did, sir. Who said that? I'm running. See you later, loser. I'm out of here. We only have eight bullets left for that. Does this use the same bullet ammo as the handgun? Shit, it does, you know. Okay, well, that's not good. I'm going for three headshots in a row and I'm fuck it. Yes, dude! That was nasty. How'd you shoot back, boy? I'm backing up, I'm backing up, I'm backing up. Fuck, there's another one? We're in trouble. Dude, no way you have to reload this much. Thank God we read. Fucking hell, you suck, dude. The other one came along. Damn it. There was too many there. I don't know where the hell they all came from, to be honest. Dude, these no nukes are too OP, man. All right, let's fucking chill. Let's chill. Let's chill out here. All right. Your head's peeking right at me here. I gotta go for the head. Oh my god, I one shot at him. Her. You got titties. That's a girl. All right, let's go, man. One shot. That was beautiful. That was beautiful, man. Got some radiation up here too. Which ain't ideal, but all good. All right, we'll take that. We'll take the jet. Oh, oh, fucking Jesus, man. Chill with that shit, man. What's your issue, bro? You want to play? Let's play. Go for your head. I'll go for your head immediately, baby. Critical strike. Your head's gone. How do you feel now, sir? I'd like to ask you how you feel now, sir. You feel stupid? Yeah? That's what I thought. I think we're pretty close. You've discovered Anacostia Crossing. I'm guessing there's gonna be enemies around here. Is this Rivet City? There's a merchant here. Yeah, that we made it. Let's go. We're nasty at this game, boys. What's up with this freaking thing right here? What's Hello. up, buddy? How you doing? Can I talk to you? Ah, uh, fellow student on the path of the wasteland. Indeed. Welcome to my humble caravan. Please. Don't relax, know if that's what I'd call it. For we are in a place of safety. The type of safety that can only be ensured by an abundance of weaponry, both wicked and awesome. All of which can be yours for the right price. I like the sounds of that, Lucky. You repair I'll something? See if I can't take a whack at it. I don't know. What do we even want repaired? We ended up with more money there, actually, than we lost, so. Another Sweet. satisfied customer. Damn right, Keep baby. Your sharp and your eyes I'll have for more money than I came here with. Of course I'm satisfied. Hey. Hey. Keep it on the level and everything will be fine. Oh, I can't no worries about that. So Rivet City, is this you? Is this how I get into you? Pause. Hey buddy, what you doing up here? Carlos? Please, you have any water? I'm so thirsty. I've been drinking this irradiated shit and I I can't do it. I just throw it up now. I need purified water. I don't have water. purified Please. water, sorry. If you find any Right, I know where um why did that seem like I was about to shoot him? Welcome to Rivet City. Please wait while the bridge extends. Alright, Carlos, I'm gonna get you some purified water. Don't you worry, sunshine. Uh, let's put our gun down. We're entering a nice uh that statue's pretty fucked up though. We're entering a nice city. Carlos, I'll get you water, don't you worry, buddy. I don't think I could have bought water off that guy or anything, right? Nah, I don't think so. Alright, that's a pretty badass bridge to come over. 
So this, they've turned this into a little town. That's actually really cool. I like that. And it's pretty goddamn big, eh? Hold it right there. What's up, Harkness? State your business in Rivet City. I'm looking for my father. And who might your father be? If he lives on this boat, I know. Yep. Dr. Lee, eh? Well, then I guess you'd have to ask Dr. Lee for more information. Go on up then. She's probably in the science lab. But keep your nose clean. You hear me? I got you, bro. I suppose. Where is Dr. Lee's lab? The door on the left goes to the stairwell. From there, just keep heading west. Okay. We're the safest, most secure city in the wasteland. Nothing can get in here without our say so. Does seem pretty safe. Carry on then. Thanks, buddy. Kind of reminds me of the. Um, the city in Dying Light 2 recently. Where they have it like up on, on top of that thing. Reminds me of that a little bit. Trap, no, what's up, buddy? Don't care. Keep it short. What's your problem? Loosen up, pal. I'm short on time, and your five minutes are up. See ya. All right, jerk off. I'm gonna steal your Chinese assault rifle, buddy. What's up now? Oh shit. Oh no. I got fucking locked in his room, dude. <laughs> are you kidding me, man? I'm locked in, bro. Come on. Buddy, are you kidding me? Do I have to reload or some shit? God damn it, dude. Oh, that's some more shit. All right, I think I don't think it takes me uh, too far back anyway. We're fine. <laughs> that's hilarious, though. My glasses are getting fogged up. It's kind of hot. Oh, shit. No, no, did not mean to go do again. <laughs> what a chaotic couple of minutes. I get locked in the bloody in, in that guy's room, and then I punch the goddamn guard by accident. What's up, buddy? Don't know you. Don't care. Yeah, this Get time you. I'll say something different. See. What... You're kidding, right? Flack and shrapnel's in the market. I'm shrapnel, you idiot. All right. Well. Try the muddy rudder. They don't ask too many questions down on the lower deck. All right, thanks. Yeah, see you. All right, see, so we, we went with a different approach this time and it wasn't too bad. All right, science lab is this way. I kind of want to explore the ship a little bit after as well and kind of see what's going on on this thing. It does seem very interesting. Science lab is in here. Hello, doctor. Are you Dr. Lee? And you are? Anna Holt, Dr. Zimmer. Oh, don't know about your runaway robot. I swear Anna Holt, that name sounds familiar, did we? Look, this is a restricted area. I'm tired of telling you people. Shut up. I it's you. Yeah. Heavens, you look so much like him. You're James's son, aren't you? What are you doing here? You were too young to remember, and I suppose James never spoke of me. Typical. I am Dr. Madison Lee. I worked with your parents many years ago. Now I run the science lab here in Rivet City. It was Maybe this is where we were born? When your Are, mother died, your father she decided it, maybe? to leave with you. He abandoned our work. We had no choice but to do the same. Hmm. Yep. Yeah, that's pretty much what happened then. I suppose so. I worked with them for several years until until your mother died, and your father decided it was time to leave. What else do you want to know? Yes, your mother was. Well, she was a good woman. A very dedicated scientist. Your father loved her very much. It was a shame that she died. She had been excited to meet you. Why did she? Complications from childbirth. None of us were expecting it. We weren't as prepared as we could have been. You have to understand, we were struggling with scavenged derelict equipment. We did everything we could. I understand. Yes. Well, uh... I'm sorry it wasn't enough. James, he was very driven, determined to change the world. <laughs> well, we all were back then, I suppose. He was focused on two things, really. Making Project Purity work, and your mother. When she died, I think... I think he gave up. I know he wanted to keep you safe, but I think part of what he did was run away. But it seems that he never really was able to get over the idea. I'm frankly shocked that he waited all this time and wants to try again. Indeed. Okay. Talk about something else. Uh, let's... What? Ask more about her. I'm not sure what there is to tell. 
Your father and I, we worked together for a long time. I, I think we were really on to something. But then there were complications. The project was abandoned and your father disappeared. I returned here to Rivet City and established the lab you see before you now. Tell us about it a project little bit then. Purity, we called it. What do you want to know? What was the point of it? The plan was to build a facility that could purify all the water in the tidal basin at once. No radiation, no muck, just clear water. It just turned out to be more difficult than we anticipated. We had the basic principles down, we understood most of the science behind it, but the radiation in the area is so pervasive. Small-scale tests were fine, but any time we tried to test the process on a larger scale, it was just... too much. Maybe if we'd had more time, or better equipment. Hmm. You happened. It wasn't just you. We had more problems than we could handle already, but your birth is what finally pushed it over the edge. Your father decided that you were more important than everything we'd been working for. Damn, make yeah. me feel like shit, I guess. <laughs> he left all of us. Once he yeah, she's not over it. decided we weren't worth their time anymore. Without their protection, we had to abandon the purifier. Mm, yeah, she's very bitter about it. Okay. Clearly. This is the Rivet City Science Lab. It's taken many long years to put together, but we've done well for ourselves. Our work on portable fusion power and hydroponics are coming along quite nicely, if not quite according to schedule. You mean you haven't? I assumed he sent you here. For that matter, aren't you supposed to be in a vault? James said he left you there. Did you? I was under the impression that's exactly the opposite of what he wanted for you. Yeah, well, pretty much. Well, you won't find him here. He's come and gone already. Of course. Your father insisted that we return to work on Project Purity. I tried telling him too much time has passed. There's no way it would work. Predictably, he refused to listen to me. He says he can prove it will work and headed off to the old lab. I'm sorry, okay. I don't know what else to tell you. It's in the old Jefferson Memorial Building, northwest of here. Please, don't go after him. It was foolish of him to even think about going there alone. Oh, I'm going after him, baby. Look, I don't want to be harsh, but I have problems of my own. I don't have the resources to support James's foolish endeavors or you're chasing after him. I'm sorry. Fuck you, lady. I suppose I can spare Ooh, a few stim packs. Oh, yes! It's not much, but it might make things easier for you. Yes! Five stim packs? You're a real one. Let's Rivet go. This city is one of the few bastions of civilization left in the land. We're working to rebuild our society to make the world livable again. All right. Cool, cool, cool. I have to go now. Good luck finding your father. Thank you, milady. I'll leave you guys to it. You seem busy. I could steal some fresh potatoes and stuff, but I don't think we will do that. What's up with you, Garza? Please excuse me. There is much work to be done. I help Dr. Lee when she needs equipment moved. I am no scientist. I just help with the heavy things. Okay. Fair enough, buddy. We're all needed at some place. You'll see what the hell goes on. Janis Kaplinski. Janis Kaplinski, chief botanist. What do you need? I did see a man talking to Dr. Lee, but I really shouldn't be discussing it. She's already in a bad mood. I'd hate to make it worse. You should probably just talk to her about it. Already did. So long. Already did, lady. I'll be on my bike now. What's this place? Hello, Vera Weatherly. Welcome to the Weatherly Hotel. I'm your hostess, Vera Weatherly. Have you heard any interesting gossip? One hundred percent. But have you heard about Polly Cantelli? He's addicted to chems. His poor wife Cindy is at her wit's end. You haven't heard? Angela has the hots for Diego. But since he's a priest, he's been putting her off. One of these days, she's just going to jump his bones. All right. <laughs> they say Mr. Lopez is losing it. He stands on the top of the bridge tower for hours at a time, just. Wasn't that who we just talked to? She's not very social. Stays in her lab in the stern. She's smart though, real smart. It's noisy, dark, and smelly. But we're safe here. No super mutants or raiders, and maybe Dr. Lee will find a way to get clean water for us. I hope so. Take a look at our menu. Okay. Blanco mac and cheese. That sounds pretty good. Oh, I leveled up. Shit. Okay. 
Nice, 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 nice. Science, I'm gonna put up to 30. Small guns. You gain a, an additional 10% to total experience points. That should be handy long term. Oh, if I get that now, I feel like that'll be handy long term, so I'll go with that one. What's up with you, Mr. Buckingham? Welcome to the Weatherly. Mr. Buckingham at your service. Who's your owner? I serve Miss Vera Weatherly, proprietor of the Weatherly Hotel. Not that it's any of your business. <laughs> Fair enough. All right. He has the same stuff as as her. Hey. What are Tammy? you doing? What are you on about James? What do you want? My mom is probably drunk and my dad's dead. Is that good enough for you, asshole? Mm -hmm. I don't think I needed to hear all that. Jesus. I mean, it's my fault for asking, I guess. <laughs> hey. This is cool. Little market. Got guns. Got everything. Have a seat anywhere. Someone will be Hey, don't tell me what to do, alright? Alright, this is the exit, actually. Perfect. So, let's have a look at our map. See where we're going next. Well, see the see the way they still have a fucking thing so it's telling me to go up to the Washington Monument. Why? I must be there must be some side quest there or something. But when I check my quest, there's nothing there. That's what's kind of confusing me. There's the Jefferson Memorial. Anyway, guys, we'll we'll discover that in the next part. I hope you guys enjoyed this video. If you did, make sure to drop a like. It's the best way to let me know you enjoyed the content. We'll be back with more Fallout in the very near future. It's been my pleasure to serve you all. Thanks so much for watching this series. I'd love to make it into a full one now at this point. Um, so yeah. Show the support, drop a like, and I'll see you guys next time. Pleasure to serve you all. Peace out.